Today we're taking a look at Allo, a new minimalist launcher that it's coming to you very soon. Let's get started. If you're new to the channel, my name is Jose, and here we talk about digital minimalism. So if that's something that interests you, make sure to subscribe. Today we're taking a look at Allo, another launcher. I have featured other minimalist launchers in the channel, so make sure to check them out if that's something that you want. Essentially, Allo takes over your phone, but it has an option to exit, which I think is what differentiates this launcher from most of the other ones. When it comes to the design, it only has tools on the main screen phone, calendar, clock, camera, torch, calculator, and settings. And essentially it doesn't open other apps. So it's not a launcher to other apps, but it has all of these apps baked in into the launcher where I think this is what it's notable. It takes over your phone, it takes over your messages, but it still allows you to have your contacts and everything else. And if you want to exit Allo, again, not have a productivity session, you can do so. You go to settings, and in the settings, you have sounds and notifications, camera, hotspot, focus mode, all settings, and dark mode. When you get to all settings, it just opens the app. I think that's the only time that it opens the app, but you can get to all of the other stuff if you want to. What I like about Allo is that it allows you to decide when you're going to get into productivity. So you set it as a launcher, but you can also exit it if you need an extra app here or there. It only has tools, so it's there to make sure that you're focused, but if you need to access something else, you can also exit it. All of the other launchers, they completely take over and they have different philosophies. And again, I have reviewed them, but if you have any other launchers that you want me to review, make sure to leave them in the comments below. A couple of extra notable features that are coming is that it will allow you to pin different things in the home screen. As far as I understand, if I'm mistaken, of course, Simone will contact me. Simone contacted me to actually get this on beta. It is on beta right now, and I've been able to test it over the last couple of weeks, but if you want to check it out, go to this website or the website that is in the description below. It's fuji.allo or something like that. It's kind of long, so I wasn't able to just say it on the fly. But essentially, it's a very good minimalist launcher that has a purpose for productivity sessions. And then you can exit it once you need to go on an Uber or take a Google Maps or whatever it is. What I like is that essentially it bakes everything in into the launcher and you don't have to swap or it's not just a launcher to open other apps like the other ones like before or like Slim Launcher or things of that nature. But again, it's a very good alternative. and. Right now it's in beta, so if you want to test it, go to the website in the description below and make sure that you take some testing time. If you have any questions about Allo or about anything else, make sure to leave it in the comments below. I'll be reviewing a couple of extra devices in the future. And again, thanks for watching the video and I'll engage with you in the comments. See you next time.